Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the 25th tutorial in this course and in this tutorial we'll be talking about the while loop in Perl. So a loop in programming allows you to execute uh, a bunch of statements a bunch of times, right? And uh, if uh, you have some piece of code that you might want to execute multiple times and you have to use loops and um, you know among the the options that are available to us in the family of loops uh, the while loop is my personal favorite and uh, that's why I decided to start the discussion on loops uh, with the while loop and uh, also in terms of syntax it's it's very simple so uh, you could decide the number of times you want to execute uh, you know certain piece of code uh, on the basis of uh, some condition or you could uh, decide that number in advance like you know in 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 this case what i'm trying to do uh, by the way the the script that i'm using in this tutorial is called while and in this script on line number 3 i have uh, created a scalar variable x which has a value 10 so what i'm trying to do is you know display values of x from 10 till 20 and uh, there are two things that I have to do. First of all, I have to display the value of x and uh, you know from 10 to 20 I'll have to display 10 values and uh, then I also have to update the value of x uh, so that we see a different value each time. We don't want to see 10, 10 times, we want to see 10, 11, 12, 13, so on and so forth and um, also uh, we need to check when x reaches 20 because if it reaches 20 then we have to stop printing you know uh, if I put uh, 2 million here then maybe the script would just keep on executing and you know it would run into some kind of an endless loop and we don't want that so this number has to be well within reach of you know feasible range basically so uh, the syntax of while loop is very simple on line number five I have written the keyword while and then within parentheses you just have to put your condition so in our case our condition is that x has to be less than or equal to 20 let me you know in fact just make it less than 20 so that we don't even see 20 and uh, then within the body of while you start the body of while with uh, an opening curly brace and you end it with the closing curly brace uh, similar to if or uh, else and then on line number seven I have a print statement that is just going to display the value of x the current value of x and then since I don't want this loop to run forever I'll have to update the value of x so that this value gets nearer and nearer to this value right so the step by which I update the value of x determines the number of times this loop is going to run so if suppose I type in here dollar x is equal to dollar x plus 100 then the loop is only going to have one iteration because it's going to check whether 10 is less than 20 of course it is so it's going to print the value of x then it's going to update x it's going to make it 110 and then 110 is not going to be less than 20 so it's not going to execute whatever is there inside uh, the body of while right so let me execute the script and we see numbers from 10 to 19 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 and uh, if I change the step size to 5 instead of 1 you know we are only going to have two iterations 10 and 15 because the third time x becomes 20 and it is no longer less than 20 if I would put equal to here then you know the loop would have three iterations so that is while loop for you I hope you guys had fun watching this video you may subscribe to my channel if you haven't already I'm going to see you in the next video till then take care